Today's video is on jet transforms and difference equations. See here, what is this jet transform? The z transform of a function f of n is defined as z of f of n is equal to sigma n is equal to 0 to infinity f of n into z power minus n. And here are some standard functions. See, remember, z of 1 is equal to z by z minus 1. Is it not very easy? z of 1 is equal to z by z minus 1. And z of n is equal to z by z minus 1 whole square. And z of a power n is equal to z by z minus a. And again, the most important function here is z of n power p is equal to minus z into d by dz of z power n power p minus 1. See here, using these four, so I am going to solve the most important questions from z transforms. And here is the repeatedly asked question here. Using z transforms, find z of n square, z of n cube and z of n power 4. So, we need two functions here. The first one is, as you know, that for the solution 1 z of n square, as you know that z of n is equal to z by z minus 1 square. So, here z of n is equal to z by z minus 1 square. And again, we have a standard function that z of n power p is equal to minus z into d by dz of z of n power p minus 1. So, here we need z of n square. So, now I am going to keep p is equal to 2 in this standard function. Therefore, z of n square is equal to minus z into d by dz of z of here it is 2 minus 1. In place of p, I am substituting 2. And this will be minus z into this is d by dz of z of n power 1. As you know that z of n is equal to z by z minus 1 whole square. So, this is d by dz of the value here is z by z minus 1 whole square. Now, I am going to make a derivative with respect to z and again I am going to multiply with minus z. So, see here z of n square will become z of n square is equal to minus z into d by dz of this is z by z minus 1 whole square. So, now I am considering this as u. So, this value as u and this value as v and the derivative of u by v is nothing but see here this is v square v u dash minus u v dash. So, in this formula if I apply the numerator and denominator and I will be getting the value of z of n square. So, z of n square is equal to minus z times of. So, this is v square. So, what is v here? z minus 1 whole square. And again, I have to make a square for v. And again, I have to leave v as it is. So, this is v I am leaving as it is. And for u, I have to make a derivative. For z, the, the derivative is 1. And again, I have to leave u here. So, u is nothing but z. v, I have to make a derivative. So, this will be 2 times of z minus 1 power 1. So, this is how we have to solve u by v rule. So, this is z of n square is equal to minus z times of. So, here I am taking z minus 1 common. So, here it will be 1 z minus 1 minus 2 z by. So, this is z minus 1 power 4. Clear? So, if I cancel this for 1 time, so 3 remains. And see, this will be minus z times of. So, this is z minus 1 minus 2 z by this is z minus 1 whole cube. And now r z of n square. So, z of n square is equal to minus z times of. So, this is plus z and minus 2 z. So, this will be minus z minus 1 by z minus 1 whole cube. If I multiply, then z of n square value will become z square. Minus into minus plus z square plus z by z minus 1 whole cube. And this is going to be our z of n square answer. And the second solution here is, next one, the second solution here is z of n square n cube. Now we have to calculate z of n cube value. For that we have a standard formula 
that is z of n power p is equal to minus z into d by dz of d by dz of z of n power this is p minus 1. So, I need cube. So, now I am going to substitute n is equal to 3 here. So, if I substitute n is equal to 3, see what happens. Now, this will become this is z of n cube is equal to minus z into this is d by dz of z of n power this is 3 minus 1. So, this is going to become z into this is d by dz of this value is z of n square. As you know that z of n square value just now we found z of n square value is nothing but see this is z of n square is equal to z plus z square by z minus 1 whole cube. So, if I make a derivative with respect to z and multiply with minus z, I will be getting the value of z of n cube. Therefore, z of n cube is equal to minus z into this is d by dz of this is z plus z square by z minus 1 whole cube. As you know that I am going to use uv rule. So, this is uh, u and this is v. So, the formula here is v square v u dash minus u v dash minus u v dash. So, in this formula if I apply c this will be so z of n cube value will be z of n cube value will be minus z times of v square. So, this is minus z minus 1 whole cube into square and this is v again z minus 1 whole cube. You have to make a derivative. For this the derivative for z is 1, for z square this is 2z. Now, I have to leave u as it is that is z plus z square and again I have to make a derivative for this. So, this is 3 times of z minus 1 whole square clear. So, z of n cube is equal to minus z times of. So, z minus 1 whole square I am taking it as common. So, here what remains this is z minus 1 into 1 plus 2z minus this is 3 times of z plus this is z square by. So, this is z minus 1 power 6. So, if I cancel for 2 times, so 4 remains. So, this is going to become minus z times of, this is z minus 1, this is 1 plus 2z minus 3 times of z plus z square by, this is z minus 1 power 4. So, this is minus z times of, if I multiply, this is z plus, this is 2z square minus z minus 2z square minus 3z and this is minus 3z square by this is z minus 1 power 4 and now see so this is z of n cube is equal to minus z times of if you observe this one so here minus 3z square and minus 2z square see here if i multiply this one this is z this is 2z square, this is minus 1. So, this is minus 1 and this is minus 2z. And this is minus 3z minus 3z square by z minus 1 power 4. Now, see here, minus 3z square plus 2z square. So, this will be minus z square. And here it is minus 3z. And here, if you observe this one, minus 3z minus 2z minus 5z plus 1z. So, this is minus 4z and this value is minus 1 by z minus 1 power 4. So, if I multiply with minus z then z power n cube value is going to become. So, if I multiply so this is z cube and if I multiply with this this is 4z square plus z. So, this is z by z minus 1 power 4 and now our z of n cube value n cube value is equal to so first z and next one 4 z square and next z cube by 
z minus 1 power 4 is our solution z of n cube and finally we have to find out z of n power 4 and now see here this third solution here as you know that z of n cube value is nothing but z plus 4 z square plus z cube by z minus 1 whole power 4 in our solution so what is the solution which we are going to give this is solution 3 so we need z of n power 4 so for that we have a standard formula that is z of n power p is equal to minus z into d by dz of z of n power this is p minus 1 so here we have to substitute p is equal to 4 so if i keep p is equal to 4 in this standard function then i am going to get z of n power 4 that is minus z into d by dz of this is z of n power this is 4 minus 1 so this value is minus z into d by dz of z of n cube so what is our z of n cube value this is minus z into d by dz of so this value is nothing but z plus 4 z square plus this is z cube by z minus 1 power 4 and again i am going to use uv rule so this is u the numerator is u and the denominator is v and formula here is this is v square v u dash minus u v dash so if i substitute here so this is minus z times of v square that is z minus 1 square 4 to z this value is 8 and again i am going to write v here v as it is and u dash so for this i am going to make a derivative for z this is 1 for 4 z square this is going to become 8 z and this is nothing but 3 z square minus u i have to leave as it is that is z plus 4 z square plus z cube and v dash so this is v so this is 4 times of z minus 1 whole cube clear and now i am going to take z minus 1 whole cube common from this so this is z minus 1 whole cube if i take common see what remains here z minus 1 into 1 plus 8 z plus this is 3 z square and here this will be 4 times of z plus 4 z square plus z cube by this is z minus 1 power 8 so if i cancel for three times so how many times are left over five times and now if i multiply this is minus z times so if i multiply inside this will be z plus this is 8 z square and if i multiply this is 3 z cube clear if i multiply with negative sign minus 1 minus 8 z minus 3 z square if i multiply with 4 this is minus 4 z minus 16 z square minus 4 z cube by z minus 1 power 5 and next one this is minus z times of so if you watch clearly so this is z cube 3 z cube and this is minus 4 z cube so this will be minus z cube and see if you watch there is 8 z square minus 3 z square and minus 16 z square so this is 8 minus 8 9 10 11 so this is minus 11 z square and the next one here is z terms here it is z minus 8 z minus 4 z so this is minus 11 z clear and here there is a single constant minus 1 by this is z minus 1 power 5 so if i multiply with this therefore z of n power 4 will be so this is z power 4 plus 11 z cube plus 11 z square and this is minus of minus plus z by z minus 1 power 5 and see here so this is our final answer so the value of z of n power 4 is nothing but 
z power 4 plus 11z cube plus 11z square plus z by z minus 1 power 4. So, if you follow these four uh, uh, standard functions and if you apply n is equal to 2, 3, 4, we will be getting the value of z of uh, uh, n square, n cube and n power 4 and if you practice definitely you can solve by your own. Please if you really like this video please share it to your friends and I will be posting the most important uh, solutions. Uh, please practice and score more.